in my last video, I said I would do a new video regarding what I use to keep my hair healthy, shiny, and conditioned. As a flight attendant, I do work in a very dry environment and it does wreak havoc on my hair. It makes it dry, staticky. It's a lot of work to bring it back to life per se. So I thought I would do this video and show you what I use on my hair to keep it healthy, shiny, and whatnot. And also show you what I use to keep it looking immaculate. Now, this is generally how I do my hair for a flight. Now, it's not immaculate right now because I'm not working and I didn't want to put a lot of hairspray in it. So I just thought I'd give you the gist of how I do my hair. Just like that. So let me show you what I use to keep my hair healthy and strong as a flight attendant. So first things first is shampoo. I am in love with the Lush shampoo bars. Mm, I have this one here. It's in Brazilian. Uh, they are $9.95 at Lush in store and online. Now obviously it's not as big as it used to be. I have been using it for quite a while now. Why they're perfect for flight attendants? Well, they are super travel friendly. They're convenient for my crew bag. I don't have to fuss with bottles. Just a simple bar and away I go. They last a ridiculously long time. Um, I think on the website it says they last up to 80 washes. I wash my hair once every three days. At least I try to wash it once every three days. And I wet my hair, a couple swipes of this, and the suds on it is incredible. And I've had it now for four months. Um, obviously almost time to replace it. It has a beautiful smell to it. Mm, it's made with, um, I think, orange oil. And it just has the most beautiful citrusy scent. It really wakes you up, especially when it's two in the morning or you have a late night flight and you just want something to kind of perk you up, that's it. It keeps my hair soft, shiny, and the scent actually lasts all day. Um, I can't go wrong with this one. It'll be repurchased again and again. Now for a conditioner, this one might cause a bit of controversy because it is a Pantene product. It is the Pantene Color Preserve Shine Conditioner. A lot of people do not like Pantene because it does contain a lot of silicones and are believed, of course silicones are believed to do more damage to your hair than good. But for me, I love the fact that it hydrates my hair, makes it manageable, and keeps my color vibrant as it is quite red. It does preserve it. Um, obviously I don't bring this bottle, I do keep it in a travel size container, but it's... I think it's great for keeping my hair soft and hydrated. Now, in between washes, I use dry shampoo. I have used many dry shampoos. I've used Batiste, Gosh, Pantene, Garnier. Um, I can't think of the other ones I've used, but you name it, I've probably used it. And a couple months ago, I was shopping in Winners, and I came across the Colab dry shampoo. That's it there. Um, it's, it's really actually surprisingly good for a dry shampoo, I must say. It, I find with other dry shampoos that I've used, especially Batiste, when you spray it in your hair, it leaves your hair wicked stiff. So when you brush through your hair, you gotta fight through it. This stuff does not do it. I find I spray it in my hair, I leave it for a couple minutes while I get dressed, and then I run my fingers through it and massage it a bit and brush it out leaves my hair soft and full without the dryness. It actually comes in scents. This one is Tokyo. It's called an oriental scent. I don't know what oriental scent is, but it is kind of fruity, florally. I did, was out the other day and I bought another one, the Monaco, which is supposed to be a fresh fragrance. These are available in drugstores such as Shoppers, Rexall, and I'm guessing in the States, CVS and Walgreens. In Canada, they do retail for $9.99. However, at Winners, they do retail for $7.99. So it's a $2 savings. It's pretty great for the price. 
anything else with other dry shampoos that this doesn't do is, especially Batiste, it will make my hair look dull. And this stuff doesn't. It actually makes it look soft and touchable and supermodel-like. This product is, it's a 10 Miracle Leave-In Plus Keratin. This is my, what's the word I'm looking for? My ultimate. It contains so many oils and I think bamboo extract and it keeps your hair strong, healthy. The argan oil obviously conditions it. It is amazing for flayed attendant hair. It is, oh my god, it does, it does everything. Um, heat styling protectant, strengthens hair structure, seals cuticle for extra silky hair, detangles, etc, etc. Big thing for me is that it conditions the hair. When I'm stuck in a flying metal tube all day and that recycled air dries out my hair, this will combat it, no problem. Add shine, it defrizzes my hair, um, strengthening it, like that's a big thing for me. Uh, it retails for, I think I believe, I'm gonna, can't remember exactly, but it was around the ballpark of $24 available in salons. Um, after I wash my hair when it's damp, give it a good shake, spray it maybe four times, rub it in between my palms and put it through my hair and it just makes my hair look so good, especially after when I've been flying for a long time and I really start to notice the effects of the airplane air on my hair. This stuff fixes that. It's great. Something else I like to use when I'm... After I finished a long stretch of flights and my hair has really had it with all the um, hairspray, the environments, everything, like salt water, you name it when I'm on layover. What I like to do is use coconut oil. This one is the Nutiva. Coconut oil is amazing for putting moisture back in your hair, making it manageable, soft. It's terrific stuff. What I like to do is I will saturate my hair in coconut oil. I don't do just a tablespoon and rub it through my hair and leave it overnight. No, I scoop it out, scoop it out, and I make sure every strand is soaked with coconut oil. Then I put in, put it into a shower cap and I sleep on it all night, usually nine hours of sleep. Wash it out the next morning, usually takes a couple washes to get it all out completely. It leaves my hair soft, full, shiny, I'm able to style it more easily. It's not all over the place. So after a long layover, I definitely use coconut oil. Also, a good use for this stuff is when my ends are really starting to get dry. Because you all know your ends will go first. I will take just a little, maybe even like, not even a teaspoon, and I'll rub it in my hands and I'll just pull it through the ends of my hair just so they can get some extra moisture. It, it does help. I'm quite impressed with how this works. I'm on the coconut bandwagon and as a flight attendant I swear by this. For conditioning to add shine is the Sage Natural Wellness Jehovah Oil Carrier Oil. I bought this at, I think it's called Sage? Sage Sage for $9.95. It adds a natural shine, a bit of conditioning power to it. It lasts forever. I have had this tube now for five months and I'm not even halfway through. So what I will do before I put my hair up when it's dry, I will p take maybe four drops of this stuff, rub it in between my palms and just pull it through my hair before pinning it up. It keeps it soft, it adds a hint of shine without being artificial. When I'm done a flight for a day, if I'm on a layover or I plan on going out after work, after my hair's out, I brush out all the hairspray and everything, I'll add a couple drops to my hair and it just refreshes it with a beautiful shine. For a hairbrush, I do like my Tangle Tamer. It's kind of looking a bit rough. I got this at Winners for, I. it's been a while now, I've had it for almost seven months. I think it was $10.99, I think, but it has a I love the ergonomical handle, the shape of it fits great in your hand, it doesn't pull at your hair, it it actually glides right through it, it beats all the snags, I'm not tugging at it, 
I think it's great. Definitely recommend this for the crew wig. All right, so this is the big one. Flight attendants have perfect hair, yes? And in order to achieve that perfectly coiffed hair, you need an awesome hairspray. I'm not wearing hairspray right now because once I explain to you about my hairspray, you'll understand why. So as a flight attendant, we wanna always have that lovely image of perfection and that includes hair, no flyaways, nothing out of place. To achieve that, I use Aussie Instant Freeze Hairspray. It's an extreme hold hairspray and when they say extreme hold and instant freeze, they mean it. Your hair is not budging out of place. You're not getting any flyaways if you're using this stuff. It is a godsend for every flight attendant out there. Now, in saying that it's a godsend, it's also a bit of a curse. Your hair is going to be stuck with this until you wash it. This stuff cannot be brushed out. At least I find I can never brush it out. It stays in your hair. I can pull out bobby pins after spraying it and I will still have my hair formed as to what it once was. It is ridiculously cheap. I think I... $3.99 at Shoppers Drug Mart and sometimes it's on sale for even $2.99. I swear by this. It never leaves the crew bag until now but it is perfect for keeping your hair in place. You can walk off the plane after a 16 hour duty day, your makeup can be melted, you can have runs in your pantyhose, but I guarantee you, your hair will look amazing because of this stuff. Definitely. Just some other things that I like to use for flight attendant hair, of course, honorable mention, is my biotin. I take three of these tablets a day. It keeps my hair full, shiny, healthy. Um, just once again, working in that really dry environment, I would definitely recommend this to your vitamin regime. Bobby pins, of course, I use the classic goodie bobby pins. Oops. Or really any bobby pins, I guess. Um, I go through these like I do pantyhose, and that's a lot. Another bobby pin I like, especially when I do the donut is the double prawned ones. I got 200 of them for $2.99 and that was, where was it? I think it was Sally's Beauty Supply. Um, they're perfect for, especially when I like to do the bit of a bigger messy donut. These ones, and it, it does hold all day. I'll give it that. Um, the double prong bobby pins never has, used to have, um, a use for them until I got this job, but now I see why they're so great. They keep your hair in your donut in any style, especially when I do the French twist. These are the go-to. That is what I use to keep my hair flight attendant perfect, healthy, conditioned, and shiny. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, please by all means leave them for me. I would love to hear your feedback. Um, I'm thinking my next video, um, I'm going to do flight attendant skincare. Let me know what you think. Um, hopefully I'll have that posted within the next couple days. Until then, may your skies be always smooth, your travel safe, and a meal option for every passenger on board. Till next time, everybody. Bye-bye.